All right, hello guys, how's it going? Welcome to the next episode. In this episode, we're going to uh, write the functions that mate to parents as well as uh, the functions that mutate an individual and the mutate a whole population. Let's get on with it. Okay, so mate parents, what it does? Mate parents takes um, a population and out of that population, it randomly selects two individuals and it randomly combines their genes. The resulting individual being uh, a child in the next generation. Is enough, right? So let's see how we're going to code this. So yeah, the idea here is to go through the population uh, and as I said, randomly pick out uh, individuals and combine them together. And put them in in uh, in this offspring list, uh, which is the one that we're gonna return. So we take two random parents, um, random dad and random mom. They could also be random dad and random dad too or random mom and random mom too or random random and random random too uh, it's up to you really what we want to do is for each of these individuals we want to um, we want we want again we want to combine their genes so the way we do this uh, and this is uh, Juice's uh, um, insightful uh, idea is um, out of the, the list that constitutes one individual, we mask uh, certain individuals, oh, sorry, we, we mask certain genes. So, so we'll, have, we'll have a list of, let's say, four elements, and we're going to write a random mask, uh, we're, we're going to generate a random mask of zeros and ones, uh, of length four, and uh, the ones in that mask, we're going to take uh, to be genes from uh, the random dad and the zeros we're gonna take to be the genes from the random mom. Uh, so basically we, we randomly combine genes from two individuals. All right, what are we doing here? What in the heck are we even doing here? Let me explain. First of all, we create a dad mask. How do we create a dad mask? By creating a, 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 a list of random numbers between zero and two exclusively, uh, excluding two, so between zero and one, of size uh, dad's, dad's length basically so so we create a random mask of a random list of zero and then ones uh, of length four in our case of, of length n genes <clears throat> next we take that mask and we uh, we uh, we invert it so whatever was zero in that mask becomes one in the new mask and whatever was one becomes zero and that's the mom mask so basically uh, these are two um, opposite opposite uh, lists, if you will. Next, what we do is we take the uh, dad ma mask and we multiply it by uh, the dad itself, and we do we multiply it element wise, element by element. And we also take the mom mask and we multiply it element wise, and then we get two. Um, two uh, genes, two individuals, which have uh, some of their genes equal to zero. And whatever the first individual's gene, genes that are equal to zero 
are the same uh, individual are the same genes in the second individual which are not equal to zero so when we put them together we get a complete individual and that's the child and we append it to our offspring array and once we've done this uh, n offspring times we re we simply return um, the offspring <clears throat> and that's it that's it easy enough <clears throat> okay all right so um, in the next video we're going to mutate an individual and uh, using that function we're going to mutate a whole population stay tuned